Hey guys, I'm LB, and that's an Animal King. This is in and out by Backwiz18, or Bakwiz, I said that wrong. Difficulty medium, funnel your way around, evade the turret, and beat the clock to reach your destination with both cubes in tow. Solution video and hints below provided if you get stuck. Uh... None of those are a solution video, I'm assuming that... Eh, English, 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 English. Right, well... Let's go ahead and get started then. Beat the clock, huh? I sure hope it's a generous timer, because, uh, otherwise I'm gonna have some issues. Oh, that just respawns that, huh? Alright, I'll just leave this here for now. And yeah, not much else can be done about that at the moment. Um, well, that does that fizzler, huh? I think you almost got this perfect, except... Oh, maybe you did. Maybe I can't shoot it at this angle. Oh, nope, I got it! <laughs> yes, I don't think that's supposed to be able to be possible, but whatever. Let's ignore that for now. What is going on with these ant lines? What? You didn't- you- you thought that was fine, huh? You decided, mm, this ant line connects to this fizzler, I'll just let it go all the way around the long way. <laughs> I think an easy way to fix that would be... ...to, like, move this fizzler over here, and it would still look ugly, but it would at least be better. Or if you have- if you could install B-Mod, you could put an ant line blocker on this side and force it to go out this direction instead. Or you could put a light strip here... ...and there, in a similar to fashion to how you put... ...them here. I don't know, you probably fought with this antline already. Who knows? That unreverses the funnel. Interesting. What's that? Oh, that thing has numbers on it. Huh. How do we even begin? I'm not supposed to pull this cube through this fizzler, right? I mean, I could, but I don't think that's what you want me to do. I suppose I can hit that, since that seems relatively intended. Um... Oh, that's what you want me to do. Okay, I see. Well, I wouldn't have broken the puzzle too much, to be honest. Hmm... That is a bit of an issue, isn't it? Although, not too much, honestly. Because I can just do this. Oh, eh, up. Let's see here. It's gonna be kinda... gonna be kinda hard to tell where the cube actually is, though. Almost. Oh, crap. Well, <laughs> so much for that cube. Gotta try again. Actually, I'm making this way harder than it needs to be. <laughs> I'm making this so much harder than it needs to be. Overcomplicating is in my blood. Yeah, look at this. Look how much easier this is. <laughs> oh, wow. Alright, well, we got both cubes out now. I'd say that's some kind of accomplishment. And we can head up here. Not that it particularly helps us. There's the turret we're supposed to supposedly evade. Interesting, we could actually just pull ourselves up right now, couldn't we? We could also turn the funnel blue and push ourselves out of that or wherever. But let's try this first. This seems reasonably deadly. Yeah, I was kind of worried about the turret seeing me there. Seems like. Yeah, this is gonna be in the way for us. So what does that button... do? Maybe it kills the turret, who knows. I mean, it's an alcove that we can run into to hide. Oh, that did not do any sort of thing that I expected it to do at all. Is there really no way to kill that turret? Are you serious? Are there lasers in this map? Oh, there is a laser in this map. Okay. 
weird, it can't see me here? Oh, it can. It just was going to sleep right then. Okay, so this timer seems pretty generous. Still makes me nervous, though. Um... Okay, whew! Right, so we will need both cubes, unfortunately. Right, so that means that one of the cubes will have to be here, and then... Wait, how are we gonna do that? Is there, like, portal surfaces here I don't know about? There must be a third cube, right? I don't see a third cube dropper, though. Huh. Then how... are we expected... to pull this off? Oh no, I think I sort of see what has to happen. I have to jump in, hit the button, fall back down, land up there, then grab the cube. That's gonna be a nightmare! Wow. I sure hope that I'm right about that and that is not what I have to do. <laughs> I hope that I'm right and I also hope that I'm wrong. That's, uh, yeah. Wait, what's there? Oh, there's deadly goo back there. I was trying to figure out how there could have been goo here when this was only one block thick. Like, there's, there's definitely no goo there, but there is right there. Right, so. We have that... situated. Hmm. How exactly is the best way to do this? Oh, I didn't even try to go up there, did I? Wow, I completely forgot that area existed. Aha! Uh -huh, it's our... savior. Maybe we can finally... deal with the turret... in some capacity. Or propensity. Can I see it from back here? No. The answer to my question is... no. Right, uh... Hmm. Let's, uh... Oh dear. Oh, well, that's... that's a thing that happened. Let's put this... here. And then hopefully we can use the laser there? Uh, mm, No, this is... Mm, no. I don't think this is a good way to do things. How are we supposed to get that turret? Can't do it from here. Are we even able to kill it? What's the point of the laser, if we can't kill the turret with it? Let's just, uh, take this on up here, and... Maybe... Maybe. No, this isn't gonna work. Yeah, there's no way we can point at the turret like this. We'd have to be... like, floating in the air up above... under- underneath the gradient here? This isn't gonna work. It's not like I can- it's not like I can tilt the cube anymore, because I certainly can't even touch the cube anymore, because <laughs> of the funnel bug. So... Um... Geronimo! Oh, that's... I didn't consider this. Uh, oh no. Uh, hmm. 
Here, have a- have a piece of this. Oh, yep, that's- nope. Okay. <laughs> Fine. Hmm... Maybe I can just ignore the turret? I hope? Oh, that's no- nah, no, stop. Cancel. Uh... Ooh, crap. I need to make sure this isn't a corporeal cube. No, I broke the cube. Come on. And I can't see that from here, because of course I can't. Uh, hmm. Can I see it from over here? Oh, maybe? Maybe? Yeah! Oh, no. Right, uh, hmm. <laughs> Will it respawn? I think it did, right? Yeah! There we go. So. Corporeal cube? Corporeal cube! Excellent. I'll leave this approximately there-ish. And then... Get the laser. And point it roughly in the direction... ...of the turret. Making a whole deal out of, uh... Just trying to murder this thing. Okay, that didn't work. I think I bumped it too. Hmm. Oh, come on! So close! Oh, come on! Oh, come on! Yeah! We did it! We did it! Alright, now I can solve the puzzle in peace. So let's see here. Um... Yes. I do believe... I understand this to some degree. So. Let's do this. Put that... there. Oh no, I forgot about this whole situation. Uh, hmm. Yes, okay, never mind. Uh, what is the best way to go about solving that problem, then? Also, that was actually a lot less time than I was expecting. Okay, right. I'm doing this all the wrong way. Let's do that. Alright. Save, continue. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And then... And... Yeah! Did it! Excellent, excellent, excellent. Right. I need to fix this guy's rotation. Can't even see because of how bright that light is. Excellent, I fixed it. I'll put this one... Oh, it doesn't matter. Yes. Right, well. It wasn't too much of a puzzle. I mean, it kinda was, but it was kinda held back by the whole turret situation. And honestly, I think it would've been possible for me to just leave the turret alone. But, uh... Yeah. Let's- let's, uh, let's just get out of here. <laughs> well, guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!